I'm Dr. Seema Kumar, Associate Professor of Pediatrics in the Division of Pediatric Endocrinology and Metabolism at Mayo Clinic in Rochester, Minnesota. Uh, our study was entitled Childhood Attention Deficit Hyperactivity Disorder, Sex and Obesity, a Longitudinal Population-Based Study. We know that attention deficit hyperactivity disorder is a rather common neurodevelopmental disorder. We also know that childhood and adult obesity is increasing at ep epidemic proportions. In this particular study, we aim to examine the association between attention deficit hyperactivity disorder diagnosed during childhood with development of obesity. For this study, we looked at 336 children with attention deficit hyperactivity disorder and compared them with 665 controls of the same age and gender that did not have childhood ADHD. We followed these individuals over time and looked at their weight and height information. We found that females with attention deficit hyperactivity disorder were at a twofold higher risk of developing obesity compared to girls who did not have attention deficit hyperactivity disorder during childhood. We believe these findings are important and suggest the need for preventive measures to be taken in individuals with attention deficit hyperactivity disorder in terms of healthy eating and physical activity to prevent development of obesity. Thank you. We hope you found this presentation from the content of Mayo Clinic Proceedings valuable. Our journal's mission is to promote the best interests of patients by advancing the knowledge and professionalism of the physician community. If you are interested in more information about us, our home page is www.mayocliniceproceedings.org. There you will find access information for our social media content such as additional videos on our YouTube channel or journal updates on Facebook. You can also follow us on Twitter. More information about healthcare at Mayo Clinic is available at www.mayoclinic.org. This video content is copyrighted by Mayo Foundation for Medical Education and Research.